Always Plays Minecraft here on 2020. I forgot what I was even doing. Uh, we have, sorry, I got to pull up my to-do list here because we actually have stuff to do today. Um, I have not recorded since end of November, I believe. That's at least the last timestamp on there. Um, I've done a bunch of little stuff. Uh, actually, I've done a bunch of big stuff, but not big stuff. I've done a bunch of mon monotonous. I can't say the word properly, so um, we're not going to try. Um, mundane stuff. There we go. That's a word I can say easier. Mundane stuff. Uh, we took on, I believe, the last uh, episode we took that we uh, recorded. Um, okay. I'm seeing things. Um, I do have these shaders on because I think it kind of looks cool. We'll see how you guys like it. Like, especially like this. Uh, we took out the mansion. And I did actually finish clearing it out. So we're going to head over here and check it out. It's all lit up. It's relatively safe. I never want to say 100% safe because I have no idea if I missed anything. But I think we're good. But we have two other things we want to check out too. I just want to check this out first. Because I don't know if I've actually checked it out with the shaders on. Whee! Fly down here. All right, so we get this all cleared out. I kept the uh, these guys here untouched. I kept the pillars in the middle untouched. I guess they are both facing backwards, which is interesting. Didn't realize that. I thought they'd be facing each other for some reason. Uh, but they are re mirror images, so that guy's got that in the right hand. This guy has it in the left hand, so we got that here. So that's interesting. We took out all that stuff. We left most of the carpet on the ground. Uh, second floor, same thing. I took the spruce out of there, so I might want to add that back. Got this set up here, exact same thing. And then the third floor, there's Enderman everywhere, it drives me crazy. Um, see, uh, I kept this thing here. We did take the diamond block out and that's not exactly in the right place. Let's put, actually put that back before I forget. Yoink. And where does it go? I guess it doesn't go anywhere. Um, I had to pick here. There we go. No one saw that. Did you see that? No. Good. Um, yeah. And then we had the ceiling portion thing in the attic. Where was that? It's over here. I don't remember where it was. We took all that down though. So, yep. So this is all taken down. So that's what we did over here. We now there's three things we're going to take on three actual mob entity things. I should really have had this fireworks out. There we go. Um, not the ravine, it was, where is it, this way? Yeah, it's this way, okay. Um, yeah, our last death point over there. Um, what's, we just got floating sky here. Yeah, the shaders make this work really cool. I know it's not, let me sit back in my chair here. Not true Minecraft, but, well, not vanilla Minecraft, but I do like the way it looks. Here we go. Now, this we gotta be careful on, because the first one, I don't think I'm gonna tackle first, I'm just gonna show it off first, was, up oh, there it is, yep. It's, we had two of these spawn on the tree farm. I was getting some uh, jungle saplings, just trying to get those beefed up because we didn't have enough to put in a storage thing. But we have, here we go, we got infinity, so we should be good. Um, oh, yeah, let's take this on now, let's just do it. Um, I keep putting this on by accident, the curse of binding. So we're gonna let this thing, the trap go off, there we go. We can fly away quickly. Okay, they're fighting each other, that's good. So we'll let them fight a bit. So I wanna try to save at least one of the horses. All of them, I, I was just getting nailed, so I just flew away. <laughs> or I didn't fly away, I just I just killed them all. But here, we'll let them fight. Oh, the horses are getting hit, but I think, I hate to say, I think their aim's better than mine. So I think we'll let them do that. Let's try to land over here so we're closer. Oh, we have three? Nice, we just gotta take this one guy out. We'll try this really, I'm thinking I'm gonna aim way too high, but I'd rather be too high. Oh, no, we're okay. I'd rather aim a little too high. He's not seeing us, that's weird. The horse is, okay, so it's just a glitch. He is shooting at us. Okay, cool, we got all four of them. <coughs> Sweet, did not expect that, but we'll take that. So we got four horses, cool. Four skeleton horses. All right, that's step one. Step two, the cat. 
that we were chasing over here before that I was chasing, I think, episode. Cause I think it actually uploaded the episode. It's been that long ago. Because it is December 9th now. So, yeah, it's been a busy holiday week. Um, uh, yeah, my birthday was Thanksgiving Day. The girlfriend's birthday was uh, the 4th. We ended up going to her mom's on the 2nd because her mom's birthday is on the 2nd in her garage with the door open the whole time. Her mom likes to keep the door barely open so the heat stays in every time we go over there, at which point um, I don't even have to say it. She says it, not the mom, the girlfriend. Um, she says, uh, cool, open it more. What? Open it more. What? Just open it more. I don't want to open it more. Cool, we're leaving. Bye. And then she'll actually open it to a not quite all the way open, but like let's pretend the garage is like seven or eight panels. Uh, she'll open, she'll have like one panel still um, slightly closed. So it really does not block the airflow at all. It's just, it's her mental victory, I guess. But it's like, no, no, it's, we're not going here. And we wear masks. And uh, while we're not eating and talking and stuff, and then we're, but we're always six feet apart and the garage door is open the whole time. And we, me and her are sitting, um, I want to say three to five feet from the open giant garage door. So. Yeah, we're uh, trying to be safe about that stuff. I'm just trying to get to the right section here because I went the wrong way. Here we go. I think this is it. Yeah. Oh, we want to go down. That's why. Um, I'm totally in the wrong spot. I shouldn't have jumped into this water stream. We're just going to get out of here. Um, yeah. I've totally lost track of what we were saying. Yeah, so that's what we did on the 2nd. Uh, the 4th was her birthday, so we played some Minecraft at her house. I brought over her f uh, stuff from her favorite restaurant. And, um, that was it. It was, oh, we watched the Mandalorian and it was super chill and relaxed. Exactly what she wanted. She's like, I want to do nothing for most of the day. I want to play Minecraft and I want to just hang out. I'm like, okay, it's your birthday. That's what we'll do. So yeah, we get along really well. And then <clears throat> on the, that was Friday, which I took off Saturday, we went back to her mom's for the girlfriend's birthday so her sister could be there we did the exact same thing same fight about keeping the garage door open all the way and yeah we were freezing the whole time so yep got out of there now yeah so i'm exhausted from all that stuff just being in the cold for two nights not in a row but still all right let's go back to where we were um over here we want to go down to the stairs this was supposed to take us down there Oh, no, I put this in its place. That's why. Okay, so we have to go up, up here. There we go. This is what we need here. This drop. Okay, this is what we need to get to. Because um, <clears throat> now back to the... Actually, what I'm doing is not stuck in a tunnel now. What we uh, what I found is... 90... 47. Wrong way. This way. Um, what we found... And down a few. Because uh, what we found was... Uh, what me. I found... Um, the cat that we were chasing near the tree farm a long time ago, apparently it's down here. So it's at negative 47, 190, and level 19. So we have to go up a bit. I've, oh, I didn't bring any fish. Gosh darn it. Um, yeah, this is a drop there. Okay, so it's right around there. Let's go get some fish. Um, yeah, so I found the cat. It just was down. I was just in that water stream, and he was just hanging out in the water stream down here. I'm like, there's a cat down here. It's got to be that same one. It's the only one I can think of. Um, this is where rockets really, really help. And fish is going to be down a level. And also, the last thing we're going to do is I keep getting drowned right there. They're coming into the portal, and I'm not sure how or why. I think there's just a another portal. There's the fish. Yeah, let's grab that. We don't know how many needs, so let's grab as much. Um, I think there's got to be a portal somewhere else. Because the only thing I think is that somehow zombies are spawning down there in our main storage silo, getting caught in this water stream, coming up here, and then turning into drown. Then somehow going up this ladder, which I don't think they can do. So I don't think that's the issue at all. Um, and we should probably sleep too. Yeah. Or there's, I think, a portal just elsewhere. Um, in the overworld here underwater or near a water stream because they're not coming through the nether. I think it's just a weird 
way the portals work where if there's one on the nether they might they might be going to the nether and then coming back here they're just not going to the nether um from elsewhere so we got to find where the other portals at and break it so that's going to be a little bit more uh interesting well, where's the here I can't ever find stuff it's the uh let me go here i fell down here oops take some damage I fell down here take some no damage okay yeah so it's at negative 190 so we go down these steps here negative 190 47 and 9 so this way height of oh 19 not 9 so we have to go up some so might even just be up here yeah, so right here. Okay, negative 47. Oh, yeah, it's right over here. I put these here so we'd find it nice and easy. So let's get this here. So let's block this off. Because I don't want him getting out or her. I mean, it's a cat. I don't know. I know I think most mobs in this game are genderless, but here we go. So the cat's stuck. There's the cat. It's a different one, so I want to get it. So come here, kitty. All right, that was way easier than I thought. All right, so let's get out of here now. Catch a teleport with us, right? Um, yeah, up here. Is the cat coming? Did the cat come back the very next day? I thought he was. Oh, no, he's just stuck under there. Silly cat. Okay, so let's get out of here. I think if we just go up, it'll teleport with us. It shouldn't drown because there's bubbles. Bubbles! Yep, there's the cat. Okay, so let's head back to our... Let's just fly here and hope he teleports in down here. I thought I saw him teleport. Where'd he go? Oh, and these all turn into zombies. I don't know how that happened. So I don't know what's going on there. There's a the cat. Okay, come on, kitty. Come on. Come on. Come on. We'll set him down here. No, I want you to... There we go. So he'll just sit there for now. Yeah, so these all turn into zombies. And he still didn't change. So that's driving me crazy. These guys just... I joined, jumped in and they were just, boom, all zombies. So now I thought that was interesting. There's, so there's got to be a... It could, no, it could just be the drown. But the drown wouldn't be able to get up here. No, there are stairs. I don't think they could have come in through there. It's possible, but if we... Oh, right here. That could be our whole issue right there. But there was... Two, no, I was attacked by drowned. They were definitely drowned, but how will we get drowned in there? Yeah, these guys are all changed too. Yeah, oh, because there. That's just dark there, so zombies are just spawning there. Okay, so we got to get a whole bunch of these guys changed back. So that could be their drowned issue right there. Okay. So this was an informative episode already. So how was everybody's new year? By the time this uploads, it's probably going to be February. How was everyone's Groundhog's Day? I know 2020s felt like Groundhog's Day to start with, but the whole year. Apparently I'm reading Rog Cod. Not mean to do that. That might have just been it. Because I don't think they, they won't go over train tracks. I know they can, but they usually are adverse to it. So in theory, there shouldn't be any train train guys coming here. But let's also, I didn't bring any glass. Let's get some glass and do this right. We and back. That was too hard. Okay, because um, if we put glass in the um, entryway up there, whew, that worked. Uh, we shouldn't get any spawns because they can't get through. They won't be able to walk through the glass. And also, the guys coming in won't take any uh, suffocation damage. And I'm hearing a regular zombie, but I think that's just because of the... Uh... So let's put this here for now. There we go. So they'll just go right through there and not take any suffocation damage. I think I'm hearing the regular zombie, but I think that's Kugaman. Kugaman! I'm not seeing any other. I don't know how he didn't get changed, but I ain't arguing. That's fine. Yeah, I think it's just with that guy there. So yeah, I'm hearing all of them. They're all lit up fine here, so that's good. But I think that might actually do it because uh, 
put an extra just torch there because yeah, if the if an Enderman puts a torch in the wrong spot, it could block the light into something, which is stupid. But that's how it works. All right, so let's put this stuff all away here. Put the glass away. Uh, we got the extra cat now, so we can have more cats and different breeds, which is nice. Oh, this did the weird reversing. Okay, yeah, sometimes the chest will open when you close them. They're weird. Um, yeah, I'm thinking we can get a uh, flint and steel, which we don't have here. Let's grab some obsidian, though, because I want to break. I don't think we actually need this obsidian, but we're going to grab it. Because I want to break. I'm not going to finish that system. I'm going to keep talking and then end up going off on a tangent and then actually finish what I was going to say in the first place. So I'm going to break uh, that portal there. See, I finished sentences, kind of. I still haven't finished my thought, though. Uh, break the portal, then we're going to search. So we're going to go break the portal, go into a different portal, then come back into this one and see if it takes us somewhere here and see if it's a portal that's near water. And why do I not have a flint and steel anywhere? Oh, here's one. Oh, there we go. And, oh, I don't think I showed this off at all. I finished, did I record that? I don't know if I recorded it. Um, we finished these off. Um, here, these are done. Um, I now have iron. Um, this is just overflow of iron. So if this thing ever actually does overflow, it, which it might get closed because this is, yeah, nonstop. Because, um, yeah, since it's now running on a server, it'll just keep going. So we have iron, iron overflow, um, cobble, and um, stone brick just because we have a lot of stone bricks. So yeah, this is, yeah. See, it's pretty darn full, so it's getting there. And I keep every once in a while just come over here and just grab all this that we can and just make it into blocks. And that'll go in the storage upstairs just so we you know kind of keep it from, oh, we don't want, yeah, 24 shirts would be a little bit excessive. Um, yeah, so we'll put these in here and just, yeah, put that all back in. Um, so we're gonna go up, we're gonna break the portal, go to a different portal in our base and then come into the one that should be here. Let's turn those floaty letters off. They're really trippy. So we'll break this. There we go. Uh, we'll go to this portal over here. That works pretty well. Coming through here. I like this water. Oh, that's just, that's, that's trippy. That's weird. So we come in here. We'll go over to this one. This is the one we should be going back in. And we'll see if this takes us elsewhere. Because that's where... The drowned always show up at this. Now it took us to the sheep farm. So there may not be another portal. It might just be somehow we were getting drowned. Like they had uh, tridents and they were shooting them at me. Um, it was, yeah, it was weird. Because there's no water over here. Let's relight that just so we can get out there. Because they could have been spawning there and then coming over here, but there's no water unless they're... Oh, they might be up top. There might be a spawnable place up here. Zombie gets spawned up there, wanders his way down, and then hits us with the trident. Because if he's up here and he's in the water stream, then he's going to... Um, then he's going to turn into a drown. But no, they, don't, they wouldn't have tridents. So I got no idea. Because, yeah, they don't... You can't turn a... Like a zombie spawner. Maybe a natural zombie can get a trident? No, I think they have to spawn in naturally with them. So that wouldn't work. I'm just going to yeah, fly through these real quick and see if we have any red that shows up. But I think these are all safe. I got no idea. So if this one you do know, please tell me in the comments, even though I hopefully have figured it out by then. Yeah, we got to turn off mob griefing. I know it's kind of cheaty to do that, but... Just all these blocks in the Enderman are just annoying. I thought those are all red. Nope. So, yeah, I think it was just the spots we had over. How do you get pushed down? How do they get? They were on tracks. How are these guys down? I got to break my elevator. Get those guys out. That's stupid. All right. So, cool. So we may have solved the mystery of the drowned showing up over here. May have. Um, let's just go up here and investigate up here too. I'm pretty sure I lit all this stuff pretty darn well, but let's just make absolutely sure. Yeah, this is all lit. That's lit. It's lit, baby. Yeah, this is all lit. Nothing there, nothing here. Everything's there. There's no water sources here, so that's fine. I got no idea where they were coming from. Unless they came over there, but they wouldn't be drowned. Unless, 
zombies spawn in as drowned when it gets harder because we have not been uh, uh, we've been in the area a lot so the difficulty level goes up so that might just be it we're just getting zombies that just happen to be um, drowned that's just weird because this is all lit up over here right yeah, they can't spawn on lily pads as far as I know I know those are all red but that's fine because it's not actually there and this is all here that's fine now we can't get out because we jumped in here. Come on, give me that. There we go. This has water, but it's all lit up. So I got no idea. So, aha! Wait. There we go. I think that was our problem. That may have been it. I'm going to assume that's it. Just hope that took care of everything. In fact, let's torch the heck out of this place. There we go. And just to be safe. There we go. Because they were annoying. I actually almost died. Because I was AFKing while working. And then I just looked over at my computer. Because I heard a weird little noise. Like, what the? And then I see that it's actually being attacked. Um, it was interesting. And I don't know if I showed this off. I think I did. But here's this. So if I haven't shown this off, here's the tunnel I made. I'm pretty sure I showed this off. I haven't edited those videos. I'm still months behind on editing. So maybe it was in here? No, I blocked that off specifically so nothing could get through. Let's super duper block it off. There we go. Um, yeah. I got no idea. Unless somehow it's through here. No, I don't think a zombie would find its way through. It would despawn before it got this far. And this is all lit anyway, so I got no idea. Okay. Well, I've been rambling for far too long. It's already over 20 minutes, so thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Please go to donate.nobodyslp.com, the host for Extra Life. It is appreciated. Aha! Didn't light that up. Maybe it was just in here. We'll light this real quick. We're low on torches, so. Uh, every donation does go to help kids in need. It is greatly appreciated. Thank you for watching, and hope you have a good holiday, a good New Year, a good whatever, and whatever you celebrate. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm not one that generally gets offended if someone wishes me a Merry Christmas. If that's what they celebrate, that's fine. Happy Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, uh, Ramadan, whatever. Don't care. As long as it's good wishes, I just say happy holidays because there's so many, so many holidays in this time of year. Um, it's, I can't keep track. So it's just like, dude, whatever makes you happy is what I wish you. I wish you well. And I wish you something, something. That's the wall. Yeah. Seasons greetings. Happy New Year. All that good stuff. It might be Chinese New Year by the time this comes up. So, And uh, we'll see you then. Happy Groundhog's Day, especially Groundhog's Day. Bill Murray's a national treasure. I was doing this till I ran out of torches. There's a lot of stuff down there. And we'll see you. Did we get all this one? And the next one. I'm out of torches. Oh, I wasn't putting them on the left. I don't know where I am. Ah! All right. Bye, everybody. Might take me 20 years to get out of here. Bye. I'm gonna stick straight up or underneath the. We're fine. We're fine.